for almost 50 years, Inquilinos, Borrequas, and Asion has become community building with a holistic approach, creating and supporting affordable housing in Boston. I'm Jenny Johnson for Comcast Newsmakers at Suffolk University's Modern Theater in downtown Boston. EBA CEO Vanessa Calderon Rosado joins me today. Welcome, Vanessa. Thank you. So EBA is an organization that touches so many significant aspects of people's lives, but why has affordable housing emerged as the most significant? Absolutely. Well, thank you, first of all, for having me today in this program. Uh, but yeah, housing is a huge need in the Boston area as of for the past 20 years. The real estate market in Boston has been extremely expensive. Mm -hmm. So, for families of low income and moderate income means, you know, middle class families, they're finding themselves in a bind to find affordable housing in the city. So, it's a huge need uh, that is all spread all across the city. And just as an example, we do have 521 units of affordable rental housing in our portfolio, EBA does. And we have a waiting list of families who are waiting waiting to get, you know, so we have vacancies right. so they can come into our properties to live in our community. And our waiting list right now is almost 12,000 families. Oh so that tells you what the need that there's out there. And we won't be able to serve those 12,000 families in a lifetime. So it tells you how much the uh, need is there. housing now, is tell important. Tell me about the community that you're serving. Yes. Well, EVA has been, as you mentioned, around for almost 50 years. And we were found that we were started by a group of Puerto Rican activists okay. in the South End, okay. where we are located. But over the years, obviously, we have grown to serve a much broader ethnic and racial community from Puerto Ricans and Latinos to a growing number of Chinese residents in our units and African Americans. In addition to that, beyond the racial and ethnic uh, groups, we serve you know, children from early childhood all the way to elders. So the diversity of the people that we serve is quite broad. So it is a vast community that you're it serving. Is. So how is EBA set apart from other developers and managers of housing? Well, what makes uh, EBA so unique compared to other organizations is our holistic approach to community development. From the very beginning, our founders thought that housing was obviously critical, mm -hmm. still is, 50 years later. But in addition to housing, there were so many other uh, needs that the uh, community had. So adding additional programs and services to help lift the community with additional supports was very critical. And as a result, EVA has become a model mm -hmm. of community development that's been studied by scholars and that have been visited by people from all over the United States and other parts of the world. So beyond the housing, there are a lot of services and programs that you mentioned. So yes. sort of explain some of those specific programs and how it, how it creates this holistic approach. Absolutely. Well, well, first of all, we want to make sure that we have a safe, vibrant, thriving community. And our programs, in addition to high quality, affordable housing, makes that possible. Our programs range from education programs, workforce development programs, and arts programs. So in each one of those areas, we have a number of programs serving a wide range of people of all ages to support them in their growth and development, and also to support them as you know, very um, active citizens uh, in the community life and in the city of Boston. Well, the holistic approach is so important, but of course, the stable housing is very important. What is it about stable housing that really allows individuals and families to thrive? Well, housing is fundamental. Uh, a family that has stable housing creates community, creates roots in that community, and also has an opportunity to send their children to the same school to, for jobs jobs, for transportation, so it really creates the roots. Think about all of us, think about yourself, how housing creates that hub where you then build your social capital in that place through education, through your job, through the sense that you, you know, and the relationships that you build in that neighborhood. And through that community. So Vanessa, thanks so much for sharing a bit about EBA with us today. Thank you. Thanks for watching Comcast Newsmakers. I'm Jenny Johnson.